but I received a Reddit message saying this game is like Gauntlet. I don't know how they knew to message me and I don't know how many people they messaged but Gauntlet Legends is one of the greatest games of all time and they said it's kind of like it so I'm gonna give it a shot here we go the game is called I hope this isn't a virus or something that would actually be pretty rough steam doesn't allow viruses right that wouldn't be possible musicians, musicians. Best play with the controller. I don't have one. It's very loud. Super loud. Uh, keyboard. Attack is J. JKL. Oh, so you don't use your mouse at all. Okay, interesting. Wazda JKL Space Shift R. I feel like this is really a controller game. But okay. Attack, solo, jam. I guess I'm just gonna go for it. How to shred. Stay in the spotlight to exit. Food restores health. Jam gems fill your jam meter. Uh, plectrum of faith become invincible. Metronome freezes enemies. Drive pedal shrinks enemies. More cowbell summons cows. Double kick pedal increases speed. Tie-dye shirt insta jam refill. Okay. So I'm going to be whatever this is. Oh, it's just a duck. I can't be this guy. So, solo. Does, does that. Jam does this. And attack. Or I do this. So they're all very different. Now, let me start off with the drummer. Here we go. This is called Shred the Undead. I guess you get a health bar at the top. Los Angeles. Pick your musician! Oh, there's a lot of press start buttons. Oh. Oh, because it's four person local. I forgot to say that. Wait, you had to play four people? Can I not play by myself? Display Languages back. Pick your musician. Pick your musician. Do you have to have four people? I don't get it. Okay. I was very confused. So I probably hold. The tour was going perfectly until the zombies suddenly appeared. 
Oh no, dude, we gotta find our van. Let's move. I'm gonna get this jam t shirt. Okay, I see I'm too moving faster. I'm wondering if, um... I'm wondering what my jam meter is. Can I hit that guy or no? Probably can't. So they're just perma frozen, huh? Okay, never mind. I like how they get damaged. I like that a lot. Big fan of that, honestly. Okay, so I can't solo right now. Yeah, big thing of Gauntlet Legends was kind of kiting them into a place where you can then easily kind of play. Oh, so my music note is filled. I see. Doing a solo doesn't cost anything. Yeah, that doesn't give me meter. Yeah, and you can always back you can always backdoor the base. Forgot about that. You kite the monsters around the base, and then you kill the base, and then you kill the monsters. Run that kind of angle. Am I supposed to collect the notes? I just got hurt, maybe? Do I have a health bar? Oh, I've not 94 health left. So is that gonna kill it? Okay, so you can also just duke it like that. I believe the yellow is how I get out of the map. Okay, I'm big. I beat the whole map. So now I'm out. Strafes zero. Enemies kill dashes solo gems jams. Okay. Find the van. shot me or some shit? Okay, so the notes is how you fill the meter, I see. Yeah, that makes sense.
if I got an upgrade that, that moved the map like that. So with the freeze, you, I should really just be blowing up their bases. And then just moving on, moving on. Dude, look at this movement, holy crap. I don't know what the chips do, but maybe their health or something. Look at this line. I don't know what the pizza is, but I'm gonna get that. It's probably just health again. What else is to find? I forgot. Find the what? What am I finding? Oh, there's a wall. I don't remember what I'm trying to find. Can I shoot through the wall? No, I can't. a lot of points or something for doing this, I bet. Toxic juice over there. Okay, nice. I soloed that guy. Some t-shirt time action. guys die to the eyes, interesting. I don't know if this is like a speedrun game, or just kind of chill. I see those monsters. That was pretty scary. I don't know what strafes is, though. I gotta mess with that. Find the van. Oh, so that's strafing. I see. And you can radar, or not radar. Wow, that's actually pretty cool. That's that's pretty unique, I would say. Kind of fucking up. Oh, you can kill the eyes, actually. Strafe kind of broken, though. Hello? So it looks like those things are uh, tokens to gather. That's what I was getting keys for. I mean, this is a pretty cool game. Yeah, I'm a speed runner! Yo! Boss time. Ouch. 
I don't know how to dodge this. Oh, you have to strafe through it. Maybe not. Ouch. This guy's got chainsaw arms. Okay, that does not work. Was I hurting him if I hit his arms or no? It's like I'm getting rolled a little bit. I can't tell what this balloon thing is. Red drummer needs food badly. Actually true. Okay, so it does not. You have to hit his body. Yeah, I need some food, guys. Red drummer is about to die. I really am, though. Bro, these arms are wacky inflatable. Give it up for the legend. Thanks for trying the demo. Let me know what you think and follow on Kickstarter or wishlist on Steam. The message will self-destruct in 10 seconds. I thought that was a pretty good game. I like that. Musician! I don't know how the sound seems like it got louder. Um, but I thought that was a pretty good game, I'll say that. Like, it looked like it had collecting, if you want to collect. Uh, if you want to clear the map, you can do that. Uh, I wonder how it is multiplayer, because I'm just me, right? But I wonder how the multiplayer is, if it's in some way harder, because... I mean, it was the first level, so it can't be super difficult. But I was able to run to the end of the map, and... One of the things I think that kind of halts you in other games is your level or the items that you have or whatever, whatever, whatever. And this game you just have a scaling, you have a no scaling damage. Um, you get, you should get better at using your moves. So that, that's one way the game scales, I'm sure, in difficulty. But um, there was a key system to stop you from rushing past the whole map, but the boss was right before the key. So theoretically you don't have to care. Um, so I wonder what it's like in multiplayer. Might be the, exactly the same thing. You know, it's just a demo at the end of the day. But I thought that was pretty fun. Um, I like that because, you know, I'm a speedrunner. So I liked the ability to go fast and kind of skip through levels. I thought that was nice. And the music actually works. Um, it's super loud in the beginning, but when you lower it, you see how good the music is along the game. I personally like Gauntlet Legend music. You know, this is introduced to me as a Gauntlet Legend style game, so I was expecting, you know, an announcer that is super cool um, and stuff like that. Um, you know, switches on the ground, things to open up and unlocked areas, um, bonuses you can go around. It had the health system, I think. If you get food, you get health back. Um, in this game, you can attack while you move. Which is a little bit different than what I was expecting. Because um, normally if you want to just attack, you have to stop moving. Um, but I thought that was pretty good. That's what I'll say. 
Especially for a demo, I feel like it did everything it wanted to do, it just... It was like, hey, this is the game. And I don't know anything about the game, I didn't look it up, any details on it, nothing. I just went and played it, that's why I couldn't even figure out the interface for a second. Um, but I thought it was a pretty good game.